What is going on everybody? My name is JLX Victory and I am bringing you guys an informed Felipe Coutinho player review. So this guy, probably my second favorite player on Liverpool behind Steven Gerrard. So I'm super happy he got an inform. So let's review his inform right about now. So he does have 84 pace, 72 shooting, 80 passing, and 90 dribbling. He is 5'7", so definitely on the shorter side. He does have medium, medium work rates. He is right footed, 4 star weak foot, and 4 star skill moves. Picked him up for 83k. He should sell anywhere between 80 to 90-ish k by the end of this week. Uh, he he did play six games for me and he did have four goals and he scored or excuse me he scored four goals and he did have four assists for me so going into his in-game stats he has 91 ball control at 91 curve and 93 dribbling which are very very good it does also have 70 finishing and 74 long passing along with 86 short passing and 81 volleys but he is also 20 years old so he's super young he can play in the cam or left mid position talk about that in a little bit uh, but he does have 92 acceleration along with 96 agility and 96 balance so this guy is a very quick and agile player he does also have 85 vision so Coutinho <sighs> mixed mixed feelings I really wanted this guy to do well because he is one of my favorite players on Liverpool uh, and, and being a Liverpool fan I'm just super excited for him to get an inform because it's long awaited this guy is definitely a very fun player to watch if you guys have watched any Liverpool games this guy's just ecstatic and uh, electrifying and that's the one thing that I liked about this guy he did play like he does in real life uh, Coutinho in real life he likes to cut across the pitch and find like a little through ball and he did that quite a few times for me uh, but I think he would have done that more often if I played him in a 4-2-3-1 or yeah 4-2-3-1 uh, formation because that's where this guy would excel in my position in my opinion he would be out wide and he would just dribble down the wing cut in do whatever he wants to play him at that left cam position that is definitely where he would be his best so i don't think he's worth the 90 to 80k at the central role but maybe on the wing ish like at the wide cam position definitely i think he could be worth the 80 to 90k because uh, this guy is super quick very he has one of the he has like one of the best accelerations of the game in my opinion i just found it so easy just to blow by people with this guy and he does have some of the best dribbling in the game the ball just sticks to his foot and he does have four star skill moves so obviously if you're a skiller you can do some skill moves with some Ronaldo chops some Burba spins uh, some rainbows and stuff like that uh also, his strength, uh, another thing to talk about. I thought that was improved a lot. That was definitely the thing that was improved the most compared to his just normal card. His strength was improved so much, and I just really enjoyed his strength on this card. He definitely wasn't a weak player, but he definitely wasn't a strong player. But I would say his, his normal card's a weak player, but this guy can definitely body off some players. Going into his shooting... Obviously, if you guys are a Liverpool fan and watch uh, watch the games, he doesn't have the best shot. Even though he did get this in for him for his goal against Man City, which was so, I was so excited when they scored that. So I really want Liverpool to win uh, the champion, or well, I mean, I want them to win the Champions League, but I really want them to win the championship and get the title of the league this year. Because I really hope, I really think they can. I really hope that they win it. But man, this guy. Not worth the 90k in my opinion, not worth the 80k. Just pick up his normal card or play him at the wide position. I would probably give him a shot at the like the wide cam position uh, before I like kind of just discard him and just not really care about him anymore, not try him out. But that is going to pretty much wrap up this review. I also have a couple squad builders coming out in the next couple of days, um, so that should be pretty fun. But I hope you guys enjoy this video. Uh, if you guys want any anything on my channel like pink slips, wager matches, just let me know. Let me know in the comment section below, and I'll see you guys next time.